Some big changes to San Antonio police policy. Chief William McManus has announced that no-knock warrants are banned. He also announced a ban on chokeholds in all cases. McManus says they had banned chokeholds back in 2014, but there were exceptions that allowed its use. We pulled the exception off and just left it bare bones to the use of lateral vascular neck restraints as prohibited. At the border with Mexico, there are still travel restrictions in place to slow the flow of the coronavirus. This is only for people considered non-essential travelers like those who come into America border cities to shop. Texas Border Congressman Henry Cuellar says that needs to change before the holiday shopping season starts. He says the border needs to be reopened to save businesses. Everybody's losing millions or billions of dollars. We are the United States of America. And if we can't even screen people coming in, there's a problem there. His proposal is to do rapid testing on all migrants. Texas firefighters are on their way to California to help fight wildfires. Governor Greg Abbott says the 190 firefighters are from 56 departments across the state. In addition, 50 fire trucks and 10 command vehicles are being deployed. There are already 44 firefighters from Texas and California that were sent last month. The Longhorn Band won't be there, but the University of Texas plans to play the Eyes of Texas school song before and after tonight's home football game. Brian Gann reports. Back in June, Longhorn's athletes called on the university to do away with the song due to its ties to the Confederacy. In July, UT leaders announced the university would keep it as a school song, but would make other changes to promote diversity and inclusion. The Longhorns open their season at home tonight against UTEP. Get the latest news anytime, anywhere. Just tell your voice-activated smart device to play News Radio 1200 WOAI on iHeartRadio. I'm Eric Lycom, News Radio 1200 WOAI. 